It's been nearly a week since thieves broke into a local car dealership. Police have surveillance video and pictures of the men they're looking for. So far, detectives haven't had any luck tracking the crooks down. Rachel Perry talked to the dealership owner. Rachel, most of these cars have been recovered. Yeah, Mimi and Eric, a total of eight cars were stolen from the dealership last week. Beloit police have since found all but two cars. The owner of BK2 Auto Sales caught the guys on camera. He tells me they stole over 60 sets of keys. We have not seen a lot of this, especially um, this large scale where eight of them are taken from a dealership. In surveillance video, you can see several men walk into BK2 Auto Sales on Broad Street around 11 p.m. Thursday, May 20th. Two of them, both wearing masks, are seen rummaging through the main office. At one point, they both duck down. <laughs> then, you can hear one reference the car keys and safe. I thought there ain't a safe. Beloit Police Lieutenant Dave Elrod told me the group went back multiple times, stealing eight cars throughout the night. Right now, they think this was random. There was, there's been a, a string of these, and I can't say if they're related or not, but there were some in Illinois. There were some over in Racine County earlier this year. So I don't know if it's related to those or if this is just a random act. Lieutenant Elrod says six of the vehicles have been found, and a majority of them are in okay condition. But BK2 owner Alex Kezinyak tells me one car was lit on fire and left in a cornfield. He shared these photos with Eyewitness News showing the damage. Lieutenant Elrod recommends all dealerships take precautions. And I would say this to other dealerships in the area is to make sure that your keys for your vehicles are locked up in a safe and not accessible by other individuals. BK2's owner says he's still missing a 2005 Dodge Turan and a 2005 Jeep Grand Cherokee and tells me he has amped up the security. If you recognize the people in the video, call the police. Eric?